a ton and ton of the Christmas presents were stolen. We left our bag at the table and now it is missing. So there was a lady with a stroller and then she left with it. All right, I'm gonna try to call security. They gave me their phone number. I'm gonna try to call them and hope they have good news for me. Yeah. Get busy. Get busy. Everybody get, get busy. I need y'all to report to the dance floor right this minute. the video today I am going to be Christmas shopping and this time I'm doing it a tiny bit different at least for the wear portion I am actually gonna bring a few of my kids with me each day to pick out clothes and the reason for that is last year I had so many returns because things didn't quite fit or they just didn't like how a certain thing looked and I hated braving the lines after Christmas and so this year I think today I'm actually gonna be bringing Cassidy Lily Sadie Navy and Paisley with me to choose some of their clothes and try them on and then I usually like after they choose a bunch I have them leave and then I choose what I want for them and so I think it will be super fun so how I normally do Christmas lists is I have them fill out something that they want something that they need or several things that they want several things that they need and something to wear and something to read and read is always super easy for me this is the third year in a row I will just be renewing my audible membership I love audible it has been a huge huge lifesaver as far as purchasing so many books and I have a bunch of readers in my family that love and enjoy reading but I don't have to purchase the books anymore they are able to listen on audible to great live performers who just bring the story to life and it's magical and so this year I'm going to be renewing that for sure and they are actually sponsoring this video because I absolutely love them let me tell you why some of the reasons are I am able to create like a magical little moment with my kids we are able to sit down and listen Listen to Audible and they are able to just imagine it and it's so fun to see the lights like kind of go on in their mind as they imagine how things are coming together in this story. We listen to classics like Harry Potter or the Sorcerer's Stone. I actually got this little settee and the girls hang out. We're all able to fit and sit there and listen and it's just been really, really cool. They have imaginative, heartwarming, and festive stories. They also have amazing podcasts. There are brand new Audible originals like The Cinnamon Bear and exclusives like The Christmas Pig by J.K. Rowling. Now is just a great time to listen together. So if you want to do Audible this year for Christmas, great idea. I'm telling you, trust me, you will be happy you did. You can go to audible.com slash family listening. Listen now only for Audible. Okay, guys, I am going to go wake up the girls, get them ready, and we are going to take a little road trip about an hour and a half away so that we can go to an amazing mall and we are going to have so much fun today, eat lunch, and just kind of make it a girls shopping day. So here we go. Purple. 
Would Luke like this? Um, yeah, that's actually really cute. How much is it? Um, it's a lot. How much? Yikes! 95. What do you think? This is so cute. So cute. This is like parachute pants. They're so cute, I love them. Cute. Yeah, that's pretty cute. Would you wear that hat sometimes? Oh no, that'd be cute, yeah. Actually, really cute. Okay, then this is a yes. You already have one. I have this in two colors that I wear all the time. <laughs> and this is always sold out online. All right, then get it. What do you guys vote? No. Yes or no? No. It's cute. I like it a lot. up eating some lunch and we are now looking at Janie's Christmas list. She treated it much like a college essay. Look at that. Watch her Christmas list. Wait, that's a Christmas list? <laughs> There's like URL codes for everyone that she wants. No size and color, so that is a student right there. All right, now for a few more hours of shopping. Wait, hours? <laughs> Do you know how long it takes me to shop for 16 kids for Christmas? <laughs> this has been weeks and she can't even last a few hours. Um, look at these. Long shopping shoes. Worst idea ever. These are my shopping shoes. Hey, how are you guys? We met some cute fans. Can you take a quick picture? When we took pictures with those cute girls, we left our bag at the table and now it is missing. So we were looking for our bag and we asked a lady nearby and she said that there was a lady with a stroller that was waiting to see if anyone got the bag and then she left with it and she stuck it underneath her stroller. So we're hoping that she brought it back to Urban Outfitters because it literally has everything we bought today in it. Like, like at least $600 worth of clothes? Yeah, like pretty much everything we bought here. Ah, I can't dying. believe that. Okay, so they're having us go to security. See if they can see on the camera who took it. What a nightmare. Okay, so they were pretty much no help. They said they'd call us if someone turned it in, and I, I don't understand why we can't like file a police report or something. But yeah, I don't know. Looks like we might have lost seven hundred dollars. Yeah, pretty much. A ton and ton of the Christmas presents were stolen. We're gonna go back to the food court one more time and just see if the lady there that saw who took it. I guess a lady took it with three kids. I don't know. I would hope that she would do the right thing and like return it to security or Urban Outfitters where the bag is from, but who knows. This literally stinks so bad. <sighs> I'm a little frustrated because they said they have video cameras, but they can't share that with me. But I'm like, well, can you see where she's at and go ask me a bag? Like, well, that's kind of a privacy issue. I'm like, you, if you see on the camera the lady took it, you can't ask her to give it back before she leaves them all. And he's like, no. I'm like, ah. So Lily's heading down because she already came up here and the lady is gone. Because we put it into one bag, the stuff on the top was from Cotton On, so we're gonna check there and see if maybe she brought it there. What are we gonna do if it's just gone? I'm just stressed. I mean, wouldn't you feel too guilty to take 600 and something dollars worth of stuff? Where'd they just go? Oh, Cotton On. 
Okay, so we checked in Cotton On and they haven't had anything returned to them. So, I don't know. We're hoping so bad that someone will just be honest and bring it to security, but I don't know. I don't know. I literally had one shirt. Sure. It was pretty much half of their Christmas, half of Navy's Christmas. It was like most of Cassidy's Christmas. Please, please return it. You saw it? All right, I'm gonna try to call security. They gave me their phone number. I'm gonna try to call them and hope they have good news for me. All right, guys, I just called security. They have not heard from anybody. And they said that how I have to handle it, they won't tell me even anything. I have to handle this file of police report. So I'm just going to figure, I guess, that she needed it more than we do. And yeah, so I don't know, maybe we can go back to the stores and get a few of the things or something, but it's just really hard because that was like almost $700. That was a big chunk of our budget. And so, I don't know. Anyway, we're kind of bummed. What do you guys want to do? Do you guys just want to go home and be done? Do you want to? No. Well, now we can't go home because we got steps. We got steps back. Seven. 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 Or I would wait there until they need to see the birth certificate. And I don't feel, I don't feel bad. Can't do anything about it all. There's no need to keep talking about it. Let's just have the fun the rest of our day and just... Fun? Without... $700 worth of clothes. If we go back and buy all this stuff... Let's just put it in our minds that that was like we just gave it to charity. We gave it to charity and... We're starting our shopping spree now. Starting our shopping spree for Christmas over again. Why did we put, we were trying to save bags, you know, so we just had that humongous bag we just put everything in it. We tried to save money by doing one bag. <laughs> ah! Well, stay tuned. We'll let you know if, before we leave, we'll call one more time in hopes that the lady was nice and is doing a good deed. And good well, deed. I'll, I'll even pay her for it. Like, pay her for what? It's just all the work of having to go through and get it all again anyway. Oh. Anyway, okay, well. We'll let you know what happens. So nice. So the people here at Cotton On feel bad that we got all of our stuff stolen. And so we said today we can be friends and family and they're going to give us a big discount off of our purchase of the same things a second time. If you have a sponsor's going on, you're, we're, we won't we like take them. We'll just, we'll do, like it. We'll just do it. We'll just do it for free. All right. So Cass is trying to find the place we went to. All right, guys. Well, I don't know if you can hear me in there because my mask, but they were really nice and gave us literally 50% off of everything that we got. That was nice. From really Cotton nice. On. They, they are like really, really nice. Up. And now we're going back to Urban Outfitters to see if they have all the stuff that we had gotten for Cassie. I don't because think they do. It was literally like almost her whole Christmas. So we're gonna go back and see if we're lucky. I wish they would give us a discount too. That would be nice. But anyway, seriously, so sad. This bag is glued to my body. It just makes me sad. I don't know why. I guess it's just be grateful that, that we have what we have and that I can go buy it all again. Like at and least it was all of our stuff. Well, and maybe she can't really afford much for Christmas or something. And I don't know. But you still shouldn't steal things. So I don't know how I feel about that. But I'm trying to have a good place in my heart. So there's no good place in anybody's heart. All right, so now we are going to Urban Outfitters. There it is. Hopefully we can find all the same stuff. Yeah. All right, cast down the beanie. They have the Nirvana shirt. Hopefully it's the right size. So Sadie got a really cute sweater and- I really begged her to get it. I was like, Mom. And it was for sure the only one you had left? It was the only one I saw. Literally Do you want to go look one more time? Go look one more time. Okay, so we talked to Urban Outfitters. They're going to give us 10% off, which is better than nothing. So we're trying to find everything we had here and then we'll finish up and I just want to go home. I'm kind of sad, but we'll figure it out. So Cass was explaining to Benji what happened. So we go to their security and they can't get, like, disclose any information. They have to do a file or a piece of court. It's like a huge process. It's like... What an eventful trip. We've been filming it all. And now I just got to notice that our valet parking but they had closed back when we were looking for everything. So now I hope we can even get our car. Oh, this has been a nightmare. Ugh. Okay guys, we have decided that gelato ice cream will cheer me up. They didn't have dramatic, but like kind of is. They don't need to be cheered up. They just got all their clothes again. Girl, you need to be cheered up. I need to be cheered up because I spent double. Dad's going to be sad. I told them. 
blew my budget out of the water. I mean, you did get a little I'm cheaper because so the guys Yeah, but I was so careful to get budget, but oh well. Okay guys, we are done. We are going to call it a day. It has been a stressful day. It's been a good day, but very stressful. Anyways, we are done shopping and we're going to go try to find a car. Hopefully the valet people can find it since they said that they were leaving. And so wish us luck. This has been like a shopping trip from I don't even know where. So anyway, we love you all. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.